what they did was disgusting and horrible, and it was a hate crime, literally. Like, that's all, that's it. That's all we gotta call it. Violated, embarrassed, and still in shock. The words of 16 year old Sana Buford as she stood on Main Street in Lansdale. The North Penn High School junior tells NBC 10 two other girls attacked her Tuesday inside the school. Oh, yeah. Oh, A viral video on social media shows some of what happened after the fight started. It's now been viewed by the school district and the Ambler NAACP. The teen, a student ambassador for the school, claims one of the girls aggressively came at her and bumped her as she stepped out of the bathroom. As she took a defensive stance, a fight broke out, and another girl jumped in. They ripped off her hijab, her religious head covering. You stripped me of my religion. You took off the most sacred thing that I have on my body. It happened during Ramadan, the holiest month for Muslims. Buford tells us the disagreement between the girls started weeks ago when she asked them to stop using the N word. She claims after that there were constant threats of violence. During the fight, she says the girls kept saying, We got you now. Sheikh Anwar Mohammed with the Ambler NAACP tells us the group had an emergency meeting last night. We like to throw around these pretty words and pretty phrases in this time period like hate has no home here. Well, hate is here and hate, you know, revisited us again. North Penn School District says it's committed to developing a respect for diversity. In a statement, a school official went on to say any altercation taking place in our schools is investigated and individuals involved are assigned consequences. This afternoon, there was a protest out front of the school, but Buford isn't going to class now and doesn't know she'll ever go back to that school. Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News. There is a disciplinary hearing next week for Sana, who is also facing a 10 day suspension for the fight. Police and the school district, they continue to investigate just what happened there.